Hey guys, welcome to our first virtual foundation training session. Now that we're back in a lockdown, we wanted to create some virtual training sessions that both our foundation gymnasts and any other recreational gymnasts can follow at home. There will be three different videos each week, one for each level of our foundation classes, so make sure you choose the right one. For anyone watching from outside of the club, foundation one is our beginner class, foundation two is the next level up, and foundation three is our most advanced class. This is the foundation one video, so foundations two and three, please go back to our channel and find your videos there. For all the spirit gymnasts watching, these videos will support the content you're learning in your Zoom sessions each week. You can pause this video whenever you like if you want to spend more time on any of the activities. Please don't try anything that's too difficult for you and make sure you've got a safe space to be practicing in. Hope you enjoy! Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Today's warm up will be the body part touch the floor game. We'll start off with running and then we'll change the exercises as we go along. Whenever you hear Amy shout a body part, we're going to touch the floor with that body part as quickly as we can. And carry on with what we were doing before. Okay, so running on the spot. Uh, right hand. Your bum. Little <laughs> um, belly. Okay, straight jumps now. And your left elbow. And your ear. Right hand, your ear, your forehead, <laughs> left hand, right hand, <laughs> both hands, <laughs> straight jumps, your bum, your belly, <laughs> right hand, left hand. Forehead. And back to running. And on your bum. Left hand. Left elbow. <laughs> right hand. Right elbow. <laughs> your knees. <laughs> and straight jump. Five circles backwards. And now forwards. And from here, put your legs apart, one hand on your hip, and lean over. Back up to the middle, and swap sides. Arms up. And reach all the way down to the floor. Now sit on your bums with your feet together, arms up, remembering the string that's pulling you up, and all the way to the floor. 
Now into shadow. Arms up by your ears. Tuck your hand under and hug your body. And lean over. And back up to the middle. And do the same on the other side. And then what you're going to do now is you're going to make a diamond shape with your hands and go all the way down to the floor. Now we're going to lay on our stomachs and push up to a seal. With long necks and our shoulders down and our feet together. And then push our bums back all the way to the side. In a number one for a bridge. Then go into a number two. And then push up. Come back down. And then do three tuck rocks. And go back down into a number one. Number two. And push up. And do three tuck rocks again. And one more. Back into the number one, number two, and push up. And three tuck rocks again. Okay, now for splits, you're going to go into a lens like this and try and push your hips all the way to the floor. And now straighten your front leg and try and get your nose to touch your knee. And now we're going to slide into splits. Now we're going to do that but on our other leg. Right, and then sit in butterfly and hold your feet and lean forward. And now five side to sides. Arms out in front and just change. Now we're going to sit in box lips. Okay guys, that is it for the stretch. guys we're going to do some jumps so the first one we're going to start with is our straight jump so what we want to do is we want to have our arms up nice and tall in the air and our belly squeezed and then we go down to number two where we bend our legs and we've got to make sure that our chest stays up so we don't want to be leaning forwards like this up nice and tall and then number three four and then five with our arms up nice and tall okay so we're going to do a couple of them together ready so arms up and then two Three, four, five. Right, and then one more. One, two, three, four, five. Good.
Right, now we're going to move on to our tuck jump. So, if we all sit into a nice tuck, okay, toes pointed, right, and that is what shape we want to jump into, okay? Is that same, guys, as our straight jump? We're going to start with our arms up, nice and tall, and then we're going to go down to number two. But before we go to number three, we want to make sure that our arms go up first, and then we tuck. So, three, four, five, okay? Right, one more. So, number one, two, three, four, Okay, right, after our touch jump now, guys, we're going to go for our star jump. So, everybody show me a star. Okay, and that is what we want to jump into now. Right, but this one here is a bit different. So, instead of going up and then leaving our feet out, we're going to go down, bring them out, and then bring them back together before we land. Okay, so let's give it a go. Arms up nice and tall. So, number one, two, three, four, five. Okay, right, one more. One. Two, three, four, five. Next one guys is our half turn. Right, so for this one here we're going to do a half turn jump but instead of spinning with our arms we want to get up with our arms up by our ears and then we turn. Okay, so arms up. So number one, two, three, four and five. Okay, so did you see in her spin her feet didn't cross over or come apart, they stayed together the whole time. Okay, so one more. So arms up. One, two, three, four, five. Good, well done. Thank you. 
cool down before we finish. So get your hands together, give your wrists a shake around. And then the other one with them. And then give it a shake. Bit more. And then circle your arms around. And the other way. And then let's go down and do a seal. Make sure you've got a nice long neck. Feet squeezed together. Push back, amazing line. Put your chin on the floor. And then sit on your bottom. One foot over the other. Give the ankle a shake around. And then switch to the other one. And that's it. Well done. Well done, guys. Come back again for next week's session. See you soon.